Hello guys. Welcome back to our channel. In this video, we will talk about 5 largest luxury yachts in the world. But starting our video. If you are new to our channel, please subscribe to our channel. Let's start today's video. Every year, shipyards from around the world push the boundaries of superyacht design to deliver bigger and better yachts. The Samuda built El Musa may have carried the title unchallenged for a remarkable 119 years. But in the 21st century she has descended down the pecking order to make room for even larger and longer yachts. German shipyard Lursen currently holds a near monopoly in the construction of supersized superyachts, having delivered 13 of the world's top 25. But the list is ever-changing, with 140-meter Solaris appearing as the newest entry in 2021. These yachts, all measuring over 100 meters, are impressive not only for their hull length but for what they carry above and below deck. From submarines and helicopters to swimming pools, cinemas and science labs. The onboard features of these superyachts show them to be truly groundbreaking pieces of engineering. Read on to discover our official list of the largest, privately owned yachts in the world. 1 Azam, 180.61 meters. Built in 2013, Germany. In October 2013, Lursen delivered the largest privately owned superyacht in the world in the form of Zam. Originally, she was designed to be 145 meters, but in the process of optimization grew to 180 meters. Other stunning facts about Azam's impressive design include her staggering 13,000 GT and accommodation for 36 guests and as many as 80 crew members. The behemoth was reportedly built for Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nahyan of Abu Dhabi's royal family for use as a dayboat to reach his favorite diving grounds. The main saloon alone encompasses nearly 522 square meters and has a relaxed French Empire style and mother of pearl finishes, designed by Christophe Leone. On board features include a gym, pool and a special golf training room. 2 Eclipse, 162.5 meters. Built in 2010, Germany. After five years of intensive design, development and construction, Eclipse left the Blome plus Voss yard in December 2010. She carried the title of world's largest superyacht for just three years before being usurped by Azam. Managed by Blue Ocean Yacht Management. Her accommodation includes an owner's deck of 56 meters in length and facilities for up to 92 crew. Her interior boasts hundreds of custom finishes exclusively developed especially for this project, while her deck areas include a 16-meter swimming pool which can be transformed into a dance floor. The yacht can also accommodate three helicopters, one on each of the two helipads and the third in a storage hangar below the fore deck. 3 Dubai, 162 meters. Built in 2006, United Arab Emirates. The aptly named Dubai is the royal yacht of Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum of Dubai. The accommodation, styled by Nikhil Interiors, is designed for 24 guests and comprises an owner's suite. 5 VIP suites and 6 guest suites, all with open balconies. Special features include a 21.3 meters wide atrium, a swimming pool, barbecue area, cinema, disco, a landing platform for a Black Hawk helicopter, a gymnasium, and a garage for the yacht submarine and a vast array of water toys. Full certification was obtained from Lloyd's Register of Shipping in October 2006 and she has since made several voyages. She can reach a maximum speed of 25 knots. 4 Dilbar, 156 meters. Built in 2016, Germany. With a total interior volume of over 15,000 GT, Dilbar is the largest yacht in the world by gross tonnage, if not by length. She was built in steel and aluminium by Lursen to a design by Espinoino. In 2016, she was delivered in the Mediterranean for her owner, the Uzbekistani billionaire Alisher Usmanov. She replaced Usmanov's previous yacht of the same name, which has since been renamed Ona. She is usually spotted cruising around the south of France, northern Spain and sometimes Cyprus. Record-breaking features on board. This Solus class superyacht include her 180 cubic meter swimming pool and her 30,000 kW electric diesel power plant. Her interiors, styled by winch design, can accommodate up to 24 guests served by nearly 100 crew members. She also has two helipads, 3,800 square meters of living space AMD. An expansive garden complete with a specially developed variety of grass that tolerates salt air. According to its creator Axel Mossman. Dilbar has a single color for her exterior, a buttery cream shade, 
that makes her instantly recognizable at sea and can reach a top speed of 21 knots. 5L said, 155 meters. Built in 2008, Germany. This Lloyds class vessel, known as Project Sunflower during construction, was delivered by Lursen's Veg Sack Yard to her owner, Sultan Kavis bin Said El Said of Oman, in March 2008. Measuring an impressive 155 meters, Al Said is the principal vessel of the Oman Royal Yacht Squadron. Designed by Espen Oino with the looks of a classic cruise liner, she sails under the Omani flag and her home port is Mutra Harbor in Muscat. This German Isher Lloyd class, 15,850 GT yacht can reach a top speed of 25 knots and is reported to have a crew capacity of 150. Her paneled interiors, designed in a traditional style by Jonathan Quinn Barnett, offers huge entertaining spaces and accommodation for 65 guests. Her pièce de résistance is the onboard concert hall that can accommodate a 50-strong orchestra, but across her six decks she also has a helipad and a cinema. So this is all about for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Kindly subscribe to our channel now and press the bell icon to get more such regular updates.